Hey YouTube, it's Christina from Keystone Beauty here. I have my Ipsy bag for the month of May. I haven't had an Ipsy bag in a in month. Um, let's say, I don't know if it's been a year. I think they started theirs like last November, so it hasn't been a year yet. Um, it used to be called My Glam Bag, and they changed the name for whatever reason. And when they first started out, it was really exciting, but they had a lot of issues going on, and you weren't even sure if you were going to receive your bag and all, so I just didn't want to waste money and have to have that hassle of trying to figure out if I'm going to get my bag. So I then um, so I didn't do it for a while, and I did Birchbox for a while, uh, and then I didn't do any subscription. But then now, you know, oops, I, re I really missed, what am I doing? Sorry, it's like... I always get, you know, it's backwards on this, so I'm like, what am I doing? Um, but I, I really miss doing a subscription, and I'm, I'm sort of um, able to do that now. So I was really excited because I saw some reviews, and I really, really love the bag this month. Um, it's cute. They have done, like, so much better since when I first started, when they when they first even started their, their company. And I really, 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 really like, <laughs> I really like, um what they've been doing. This is like, it's like a similar to like a sample subscription, but these are not even samples. I think they're doing a really great job. Um, I know they have some issues now and then like any company, but so far for my first one going back to um, Ipsy, my glam, my, my glam Ipsy, um, I'm very impressed. I don't have my little card that tells you what you get and everything and kind of the description, but whatever. And the bags, that I normally got, or like the zipper was on top, so I really like this one, and I'm definitely going to be putting it into my purse. We'll start with this one. It's J-Cat Beauty. I've never heard of that brand. Sparkling Cream Palette. Um, sorry, the light's like reflect, reflecting off of it. I'm not so sure. I haven't tried this yet. I'm not, I'm not really sure if I'm going to like this, because I don't like a bunch of glitter. But, uh, you know, it depends on the occasion I might need it. And I'll be like, cool, I actually need this now. Um, it looks really pretty and all, but it's just very glittery. And I, and according to, like, the Facebook page of Ipsy, a lot of people were commenting about the fact that these are not even eye safe. It's kind of interesting how these are um, supposed to be for the eye, but they're not eye safe. Like, apparently the company did make a warning about it, um, but Ipsy hasn't even mentioned anything about it. So that's another thing that makes me a little bit, like, upset about Ipsy, because they didn't say anything, at least from my knowledge. Um, so they're pretty and all. I just don't know how I would use them, because they're not eye safe, and I wouldn't use them on my face. Um, they didn't, yeah, they didn't, I can even tell this is not even eye safe material. So, it's going to be fun for other things, like maybe you're doing like a um, face paint and you need some glitter, uh, body glitter, I don't know. I'm not even sure if I'm even going to use this, to be honest, but that's the first product. The other ones are really great. I actually love everything I have um, besides that glitter. This one was really fun. Line Fix Gel Liner for Your Gorgeous Smoky Eyes from, looks like Kaylin. It's really neat because it has a little brush on top. This brush is really pretty. Um, I just think it's really nice. And uh, I have to clean it. That's one thing I need to do. It's firm now. But it, you twist it off. And it's like this, uh, pretty much what it shows on my screen. It's like a um, grayish, me not metallic, like a grayish, almost uh, charcoal, but light charcoal color. I used it on my uh, my eyes the other day. And it does smudge a little bit throughout the day and uh, wears off a little bit, but it's I think it's pretty nice. Um, now I'm going to take that off. Oh, well. But uh, I'm really impressed with this one. I've used that once. Um, I was excited about this because they did a sneak peek of it. Um, NYX blushes. I got a NYX Rouge Cream Blush in Boho Chic. And it's really pretty. I don't have the cream blushes, so this is really fun. It looks nice. It looks very natural on my face. Um, it does. It is pretty sheer, so you do have to um, 
layer it, but that's what I like about things. I don't like things that are like bam in your face, but then you have to, I like things that you can layer so you can have a more sheer co coverage or, you know, a very big coverage. This one I was excited about. Um, it looks like Chella Ivory Lace Highlighter Pen. Um, I used it as a kind of like a liner under my um, waterline. And it's really pretty. It's not white. It's like that fleshy color. So it's going to be great for a lot of things. It didn't seem to wear too much, but it did It did um, after the days. And um, I had it underneath my eyes. It did wear off, but um, I like it. I haven't used it as an actual highlighter yet, so I'll definitely do a review sometime. So that was exciting. And then last but not least, I got a, a lip liner. I haven't tried out yet. Um, looks like something I would buy. This one's called Tipsy. Tipsy. Um, Star Looks is the brand. So it's a full size. As you can tell, it's just, they gave you like all these full size products for just $10 a month, and I think that's amazing. And um, just looking at some of the past bags, I, I'm really sad that I hadn't even like subscribed a while ago because they have gotten so many great things. But uh, let me take this off. I'll show you what it looks like. It's kind of a, it's not a hot pink. It's like a, I don't know. Let me try to get this off. Doo -doo -doo. I would have posted this up earlier, but I moved. Me and my husband moved. Really exciting, by the way. Oh, got this stuck. Well, here it looks like. It's already, it's a little bit, um, it's a little bit, not broken, but it's sideways. I'm going to have to get a sharpener, I just realized. I don't normally buy sharpeners, but it's pretty. It's darker on the on the <clears throat> it's darker on the camera, but it's like this really pretty pink color. I won't put it on. Um, that's great because it goes with a lot of things I have. Instead of like I only have like a red one and another pink one from like Revlon that I don't really care for. So this one's gonna match a lot of things I have. Ugh. So very impressed with Ipsy this month. Um, if you're not subscribed and you're really interested and you maybe on the fence about Ipsy, I just from this one and from looking at some past bags, I really think it's worth the money. <laughs> obviously, um, I don't know the value of all these, so maybe I'll put it down in the description box or maybe you can Google it. I like to Google things when I'm watching videos, um, but definitely worth the ten dollars. Um, Hey, I'm doing a video. Yeah, that's why I was coming into that door, but you left this door open. Oh, I need a darn it. Yeah, that's what happens when I don't close the door. Um, anyways, I'm not going to do this video over again. Um, but yeah, definitely click the link below to help me get um, extra goodies if you su subscribe. It'd be cool. I really think it's great. And yeah, I guess I'll talk to you guys later. Bye.